நாராயணம் நமஸ்கிருத்து நரஞ் செய்த நரோத்தமம் தேவியும் சரஸ்வதியும் வாஜம் ததோ ஜெயம் உதீரையே ஜதம்தே புண்டரீகாட்ச நமஸ்தே விஸ்வபாவன நமஸ்தேஸ்து ஹிருஷிகேஷ மகாபுருஷ பூர்வஜ சதக்ஷரம் பிரம்ம ஈஸ்வர புமான் குணோர்மி சிருஷ்டி ஸ்திதி கால சல்லய பிரதான புத்தியாதி ஜகத் பிரபஞ்சசூஹு சனோஸ்து விஷ்ணுர் மதி பூதி முக்தி தஹ ஸ்ரீருவாச திரைலோக்கியம் திரிதசிரேஷ்ட ந சந்தியாமி வாசவ தத்தோவரோ மயாயஸ்தே ஸ்தோத்திர ஆராதன துஷ்டையா எச்ச சாயம் தா பிராத்தா ஸ்தோத்திரேணானேன மாணவா மாம் ஸ்தோஷ்யதி ந தசாஹம் பவிஷாமி பராங்முகி பராசர உவாச்ச ஏவம் வரம் ததோ தேவி தேவராஜாய வைபுரா மைத்ரேய ஸ்ரீர் மகாபாக ஸ்தோத்திர ஆராதன தோஷித இந்திர அசூன் அஸ் ஹி காட் பேக் ஹிஸ் வெல்த் ஃப்ரம் த சமுத்திர மதனம் and he took up uh, the simhasanam as he went on to the simhasanam he thought of shri and uh, uh, did uh, did the stotram he said the stotram to shri so this shri stuti is a very important uh, stotram it uh, uh, praises her in a way that we think of her as uh, uh, shakti she is shakti and she is the um, power behind the creation that is here right so then indra asks for a, she asks indra to ask for a boon and he says do not leave this three worlds because that is where this whole episode started of samudra mathanam started because she left the world and went back to vishnu right or went back to her uh, the samudram and uh, so indra uh, asks her not to leave this trilokya so and she also promises trilokyam na santyakshami he vasava i will not leave this world that is the first uh, varam that i give you because you have made me pleased because of this swara uh, stotram and then another anybody who reads the stotram morning and evening will also be benefited by this yaha mam stoshyati one who praises me with this stotram tasya parang mukhi na bhavishyami i will not uh, turn my face away from him tasya abhimukhi eva bhavami i will look at him and in the sense that aishwaryam will always be present with the person who says this stotram morning and evening parashara ubacha evam varam dadau devi so after devi gave this uh, uh, varam um uh, because she was very pleased uh, uh, this thing and then the uh, parashara continues he goes back to the thread of that eighth uh, adhyaya where he had left it off right bhrugu's uh, daughter is lakshmi and then maitreya asks this question that how come uh, lakshmi is bhrugu's daughter when we know that she came out of the samudra mathana so what is the connection there uh, parashara goes back to that thread and says bhrugoho khyaktyam samutpanna shrihi purvam udadehe punaha deva danava yatnena prasuta amrita manthane bhrugoho khyaktyam shrihi purvam samutpanna shrihi lakshmi was uh, uh, before she was samutpanna she was born uh, uh, to both bhrugu and khyati khyati is bhrugu's wife punaha udadehe samutpanna again she was born out of udha samudra so udadehe iti panchami tatra so punaha udadehe samutpanna she was again born out of the samudram devadanava how was she born out of the samudram devadanava yatnena amrita manthane uh, uh, sati because of the effort of deva and danava the devas suras and uh, the gods and the asuras when the amrita manthanam happened when the churning of the nectar happened amrita manthane sati udadehe from the ocean punaha again devi was prasuta she was given birth to and she was brought forth evam yatha jagat swami deva devo janardanah avataram karoti esha tatha shrihi tat sahayini evam in this manner yatha just as how jagat swami the, world, the lord of this entire world deva devah janardanah vishnu avataram karoti when he takes an avatara tatha in the same manner shrihi tat sahayani bhutva avataram karoti karishyati 
So uh, she also, Shri Lakshmi also, that Sahayini, she takes on, uh, takes on the role of his helper, Tasya, Tasya Jagat Swaminaha Deva Devasya Janardhanasya Sahayini Jata Esha. So Lakshmi also takes on the role of La Vishnu's helper and she also takes an avatar because Vishnu cannot function without Shakti there. He is like one inertia there. Uh, uh, you need that Shakti for him to uh, function in the world. So, Hevam Yatha Jagat Swami Deva Devo Janardhanaha Avataram Karoti Eshaha Tatha Shrihi Tat Sahaini Punascha Padmatu Udbhuta Adityo Abhut Yada Harihi Yada Tu Bhargavo Ramaha Tada Abhut Dharani Tu Iyam. Now, in every avataram of Vishnu, uh, uh, Parashara mentions the Lakshmi avataram, the, the corresponding Lakshmi avataram also. So, Punahacha, again, uh, Yada when Harihi Adityaha Abhut, when Vishnu was, uh, had taken the avataram of Aditya Surya, Padmat Udbhuta, Lakshmi also came out of the lotus. That's why she is called Padma Sambhuta. So Padmam also is her uh, um, source, just as how Udhadi, the ocean is her source. In the same manner, during the Aditya avataram of La Vishnu, Lakshmi took on the avataram from a lotus. So Padma, iti ahuta. Yadatu Bhargavaramaha Abhut, when Bhargavarama uh, avataram happened, which is uh, Parashurama, Parashurama's avataram happened, Tada Iyam uh, Dharani Abhut, she took on the form of Bhumi. Bhumi was there right from before. But, uh, I think uh, here also, uh, when Parashurama was born to maybe probably to give it more uh, strength, to give Bhumi more strength, she also took on an amsham and became the Bhumi which supported Parashurama there. Illa, when Parashurama made the uh, strip of Kerala, uh, probably she came there. Adnalda Inniko, there is so much of wealth in Kerala, right? The shedip, I'm talking more about the prosperity that is there in that small state because of the fertile land that is there. So she probably, she became that dharani. There is no mention of all that. I am trying to uh, see if that could be the reason. That's all. So, Punascha Padmat Udbhuta Adityo Abhut Yada Harihi Yada Tu Bhargavo Ramaha Tada Abhut Dharani Tu Iyam Raghavatve Abhavat Sita Rukmini Krishna Janmani Anyeshu Cha Avatareshu Vishnoho Esha Sahayini Raghavatve Vishnoho Raghavatve Sati When Vishnu had taken up the form of Raghava Rama Then Esha Sita Abhut She became Sita there Rukmini Krishna Janmani. In during the birth of Krishna, uh, Lakshmi took on the avataram of Rukmini. Anyeshu cha avatareshu. In other avataras, to Esha, this uh, um, uh, is Lakshmi, Vishnoho Sahayani Jata Abhavati. She became the uh, uh, Sahayani supporter. More than helper, I would say supporter. Uh, uh, she was the person activate Pandrava Avada. Uh, without Shakti, nothing is happening. So she is the Sahayini there for Vishnu. Devatve, Deva Deha Iyam, Manushyatve Cha Manushi, Vishnu Deha Anurupam Vai Karoti Esha Atmanaha Tanum. Iyam Lakshmihi Devatve Deva Deha Devatve Vishnuho Devatve Iti Anvayaha Tatra. For, take it from this shloka, uh, 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 do a connection here with Devatvam. Because the Devatvam is there for Vishnu. When Vishnu takes on the identity of a Deva, of a Sura, then Lakshmi also, Iyam Api Deva Deha Bhavati. She also takes on the form of a Deva, of a God. Manushyatve, Vishnuho Manushyatve, when Vishnu takes on the identity of a Manushya, of a man, she also is Manushi. Sita api Manushi. Atmanam, Manusham Manyenda Rama took on, when he took on the avatara, he says, Atmanam Manusham Manye Ramam Dasharat Atmacham. I think of myself as Manushya, not as Vishnu there. So he lived as a man there. 
very few instances where he shows that he is an ishvara uh, so the same way sita also takes on a manushyatvam in that uh, manner she also shows her ishvaratvam in certain places the moment she says uh, she wants to go away the bhumi opens up and she receive she is received by bhumi so there you see her ishvaratvam there also so um, when rama or when vishnu takes on the manushya uh, janma or manushya deham sita also takes on a manushi roopam vishnu ho deha anurupam आत्मन तनु कौति लक्ष्मी विष्णो देह अनुरूपाम तनु आत्मन कौति फॉर हर सेल्फ आत्मन शी मेक्स ए फॉर्म तनु कौति एंड दट तनु शरीर इज अनुप इट इज इन अकॉर्डेंस विद विष्णो देह इट इज इन अकॉर्डेंस विद विष्णु फॉर्म विच विद बॉडी ऑफ विष्णु सो देवत्वे देह देवे देहेयम देव देहेयम मनुष्यत्वे च मानुषी विष्णोर देह अनुरूपाम वै करोति एषा आत्मनः तनुम यस्च एतत् सुनुया जन्म लक्ष्म्याह यस्च पठेत् नरः श्रियः न विच्युति हि तस्य गृहे यावत् कुलत्रयम से श्री हर्सेल्फ हैज गिवन द फलम for the stotra phalashruti she has given saying that i will not be parangmukhi i will not turn away my face from the person who recites this stotra morning and evening then isn't this like a punarukti if parashara says and this is see, shri said to uh, indra and probably that is something which parashara understood because he we was born with that purana gyanam right when Uh, parashara reiterates these things it means he must have understood it personally also that is why he is also repeating by saying by, by being more clear about what is the phalashruti for the stotra so he says yaha etat shrunayat janma yaha lakshmyah janma shrunayat etat lakshmyah janma shrunayat the the person who listens to this birth of lakshmi in this manner yaha cha pathet narah the one who also reads lakshmyah janma pathet yaha narah the man who reads uh, lakshmi's jananam uh, uh, every day श्रियहान विच्युति ही तस्य गृहे न भवति यावत् कुलत्रयम् कुलत्रयम् यावत् दिस इज नॉट ओनली फॉर दैट पर्टिकुलर जनरेशन फॉर कुलत्रयम् फॉर थ्री जनरेशंस यावत् अंटिल थ्री जनरेशंस तस्य गृहे इन दैट पर्सन्स हाउस श्रियह विच्युति ही न स्यात् न भवति श्री विल नॉट फॉरसेक दैट पर्सन्स हाउस फॉर थ्री जनरेशंस इफ ही रीड्स अबाउट लक्ष्मीज जन्म एंड और इफ ही एटलीस्ट लिसेंस टू लक्ष्मीज जन्म हियर सो यस्च एतत् शृणुया जन्म लक्ष्म्याह यस्च पठेन नरह श्रियह न विच्युति ही तस्य गृहे यावत् कुलत्रयम पठ्यते येषु चैव एषः गृहेषु श्रीस्तव मुने अलक्ष्मी कलहाधारा न तेस्वास्ते कदाचन वन हू गोज टू अनदर पर्सन हाउस एंड रीड्स दिस श्रीस्तव श्रीस्तुति येषु गृहेषु एषः नरः और येषः स्त्रीस्तव पठ्यते इफ दिस स्त्री श्रीस्तव श्रीस्तुति is read pathyate in whichever houses in those houses teshu kadachana never will there be alakshmihi um, alakshmi is the opposite of uh, aishwaryam lakshmi so alakshmi is amangalyam there will never be any inauspicious thing uh, in that house where this shri stuti is being read so it does not mean uh, uh, there are people who will come and ask you know i don't know sanskritam or i don't know where to get this shri stuti or if you know someone who can come and read adnalda we have this concept of parayanam there are a lot of people who come to that particular house go from house to house and do parayanam it is because they want to create that atmosphere for that house also so that the person people who live in that house listen to this rudramla if we don't know we call in people and we ask them to chant one is 
a lot more of people if they come and chant then there is a, a better vibration in the house better energy good energy is created in the house that is one thing the other thing is they have recited it so many times that when it comes out of their mouth it has that strength which we may not have when we are reciting it for the first time adnana adan the siddhi vandrungra you know when you have said a stotram for so many times if you even take out one shloka and give another person that is enough there is so much of siddhi in that person if you have recited that shloka so many times if they have also done it by understanding the significance of that stotra then the power increases in that person when he uh, says that stotra in somebody else's house also so yeshu griheshu in whose ever houses esha stri shri stabaha this shri stuti patyate if it is being read there he mune teshu griheshu in those houses kadachana na kadachana alakshmihi kalahadhara alakshmihi na kadachana aste never ever does amangalyam inauspiciousness which is the aadharam for kalaha which is the basis for kalaham or quarrel that will never exist in those houses so if you read shri stuti constantly every day there is no kalaham between them because it's the kalaham which started this samudra mathanam and then Uh, out of which lakshmi came and after lakshmi came the kalaham between devas and danavas stopped one thing is because the good sur- surfaced uh, mightier the, in this whole process so anything amangalam will be reduced there amangalasya shamanam bhavet mangalasya tu tatra jayah eva bhavet iti Uh, that is the concept here that's what he is trying to say so kalaha aadhara alakshmihi na aste so the p- basis for kalaham quarrel which is an inauspiciousness alakshmihi will never stay we also give a personification for alakshmi uh, just as how lakshmi or aishwaryam has a personification in the same way alakshmi also has a personification she does not dwell in those houses etatte kathitam brahman यन मां त्वं परिपृच्छसी क्षीराब्धौ श्रीहि यथा जाता पूर्वं भृगसुता भृगुसुता सति पूर्वं भृगुसुता सति वन हु वाज भृगु महर्षेः सुता वन हु वाज द डॉटर ऑफ भृगु महर्षि यथा क्षीराब्धौ जाता दट श्री हाउ वुड वाज शी बॉर्न फ्रॉम द क्षीराब्धि फ्रॉम द मिल्क ओशन परिपृछसी हे ब्रह्मन्न हे मैत्रेय यू हैड आस्ड मी बिफोर दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन व्हाट वाज दिस क्वेश्चन पूर्व भृगुसुता सती इफ श्री वाज द डॉटर ऑफ भृगु महर्षि बिफोर हाउ वाज शी बॉर्न आउट ऑफ दिस क्षीराब्धि यत मां त्वं परिपृछसी दिस इज द क्वेश्चन दैट यू आस्ड मी एंड ते एतत कथितम आई हैव नाउ सेड दिस टू यू i have given you the explanation for this question that you asked me before so etatte kathitam brahman yen mam tvam paripruchasi kshirabdhau shrihi yatha jata purvam bhrugusuta sati iti sakala vibhutya vapti hetuhu stutiriyam indra mukhodgata hi lakshmyaha anudinam iha pathyate enrubihi yehi वसति न तेषु कदाचिद अलक्ष्मी एज अ कंक्लूशन ऑफ दिस श्री स्तुति एंड द नवमोध्याय वेर द लक्ष्मी जन्म इज डिस्क्रैब द होल अध्याय इट से वंडरफुल अध्याय इवन दो इट्स हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी सेवन श्लोक इट्स लाइक लक्ष्मी इट्स लाइक सहस्रनाम लाइक ऐदर विष्णु सहसनाम और ललिता सहसनाम दट नंबर ऑफ श्लोक आर देर इन दिस एंटर अध्याय if you are not able to say the whole adhyaya just that particular shri stuti itself is enough you know that is very powerful so iti in this manner sakala vibhuti avapti hetuhu indra mukha udgata lakshmiyaha stutihi anudinam nribihi yaihi nribihi iha pathyate teshu kadachid api alakshmihi na vasati that's the anvaya in this manner by those people yaihi nribihi by those people anudinam daily ih asmin bhumau in this on this earth if this lakshmi stuti is being read 
So those people who read this Lakshmi Stuti, Teshu in those houses, Kadachidapi, uh, never will Alakshmi Navasati, Alakshmi hi Navasati, Kadachidapi Navasati. Uh, never will she stay, will inauspiciousness stay in those people's house. That is, it will always be Mangala Rupam if they continuously say this Shri Stuti in their house. How is this Shri Stuti? Indra Mukha Udgata Lakshmiaha Stuti. This Lakshmi Stuti came out of Indra's mouth. Indra is the Triloka Adhipati. If you, uh, uh, a Raja is probably just a Adhipati for a small uh, Rajyam, for a small space of land. Indra is the Adhipati, he is the king for all three worlds. Right? So he is the king of all three worlds. Tarihi Tasmintu Aishwarya Sthitihi. Uh, it will be in a magnified manner uh, in uh, Indra. Right? Uh, even Moksha Samarajya Lakshmi is also another type of wealth, which is the ultimate supreme wealth that you should wish for. Right? Not just uh, uh, Lakshmi in the house in the form of uh, material prosperity, but spiritual prosperity is the one that we need to work towards. And this will automatically give us that. As you proceed in this, Shri will give you everything else so that you don't need to worry about this and then you can think about moksha. If you are worrying about where your money is going to come tomorrow from, then you won't have the mind to think about moksha here. Anyway, so iti, uh, another adjective for this uh, Shri Stuti is Sakala Vibhuti Avapti Hetuhu. It is the Hetu, reason for attaining Avapti. Uh, of attaining all of the Aishwaryam, Vibhuti. Vibhuti is Aishwaryam. Any type of Aishwaryam, Dhanya, Dhana, Santana, uh, even Moksham there. So every type of Vibhuti, if you want to attain, this Lakshmi Stuti is the Hetu. So Iti Sakala Vibhuti Avapti Hetuhu Stuti Riyam Indra Mukhodgatahi Lakshmi hi, Lakshmi Aha. Anudinam iha pathyate en rubihi yaihi vasati na teshu kada chidapi alakshmi hi. It is Shri Vishnu Purane Prathamamshe Navamodhyayaha. We'll move on to the 10th Adhyaya. This 10th Adhyaya is a very simple Adhyayam. Uh, 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 it is actually connecting the 7th Adhyaya from the 7th Adhyaya. So the 8th and 9th were intermediary Adhyayas. It uh, 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 too manda de I think so. One minute. I'll just check. The seventh Adhyaya is where he was talking about the Srishti and Prajapatis and everybody. The eighth Adhyaya was the Raudra, Srishti and Lakshmi. And then the Lakshmi Janmam was the ninth Adhyaya. Now this Dashama Adhyaya, Maitreya, uh, uh, connects to the seventh Adhyaya and asks. Okay, Kathitam me uh, Maitreya Uvacha. Kathitam me tvaya sarvam yat prishtosi mahamune brugu sargat prabhriti yesha sargaha me kathitam punaha. We left it and digressed to Lakshmi Janma uh, at the end of 7th Adhyaya. Right? So Maitreya brings the thread and connects it back there. Tvaya yat prishtaha asi he mahamune, O great sage Parashara, yat prishtaha asi, whatever you were asked by me, uh, tat sarvam tvaya me kathitam. You have told everything to me, whatever I asked. The question I asked was, katham brugo ho suta samudra tu utpanna iti prathita. Tarhi tasya uttaram tu dattam bhavata. Aduna tu brugu sargat prabhriti from the srishti of brugu maharishi. So if you look at the Saptamodhyaya in the around the 25th, 26th shloka, he says there are uh, pitaraha, right? Bhriguhu, bhavaha, marichihi, angiraha, munihi, pulastiha, pulahaha, kratuhu, um, cha rishivarasa, tata, atrihi, vasishtaha, vannihi, iti, dasha, prajapatayaha. So from these, how did the sarga start? So bhrigu sarga at prabhriti, from the beginning of the creation of bhrigu, Punaha sargaha me katyatam. Please tell me again the srishti. Korvaya kada solinde varchana makamaran the vidmolio. Munadi nadula digressana. So when you want to digress and you have to come back to the story, you have to catch again from a part of the earlier story, give a recap and then continue with the story. That's what Parashara is going to do now. 
ಪರಾಶರ ಉವಾಚ ಭೃಗೋ ಖ್ಯಾತ್ಯಂ ಸಮುತ್ಪನ್ನ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ತಥಾ ಧಾತೃ ವಿಧಾತಾರೌ ಖ್ಯಾತ್ಯಂ ಜಾತೌ ಸುತೌ ಭೃಗೋ ಭೃಗೋ ಖ್ಯಾತ್ಯಂ ಸೊ ಭೃಗು ಮ್ಯಾರೀಡ್ ಖ್ಯಾತಿ ತಸ್ಯಾಂ ಸಮುತ್ಪನ್ನ ಸೊ ಖ್ಯಾತಿ ಗೇವ್ ಬರ್ತ್ ಟು ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀ ಹೂ ವಾಸ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ಬೈ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ಇಸ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಇನ್ ಮ್ಯಾರೇಜ್ ಸೊ ಶಿ ವಾಸ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ಬೈ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಇನ್ ಮ್ಯಾರೇಜ್ ಸೊ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ಇರ್ಕಣೋ ನನಗೆ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಚೆಕ್ ದ ಅದರ್ ಟೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ಅದ ಓಕೆ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪತ್ನಿ ಇದು ಆ ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ಇಸ್ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪತ್ನಿ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ದ ಪತ್ನಿ ಆಫ್ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಸೊ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ವಾಸ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ಇನ್ ಮ್ಯಾರೇಜ್ ಬೈ ವಿಷ್ಣು ದಟ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀ ವಾಸ್ ಬಾರ್ನ್ ಟು ಖ್ಯಾತಿ ತಥಾ ಧಾತೃ ವಿಧಾತಾರೌ ಖ್ಯಾತ್ಯಂ ಜಾತೌ ಸುತೌ ಭೃಹೋ ಭೃಗೋ ಭೃಗು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಟು ಸನ್ಸ್ through khyati they were called dhata and vidhata we already had these in the seventh uh, um, adhyaya we are just repeating those to have the thread to understand the thread here ayatir niyatis chaiva meroho kanye mahatmanaha dhatra vidhatroho te bharye tayoho jatau sutau ubhav meru had two daughters uh, meroho uh, mahatmanaha meroho kanye Uh, great mahatma meru had two daughters who were ayati and niyati these two married dhatra and vidhatra so dhata and vidhata uh, dhatra vidhatroho te bharye um, uh, the jatau jate na uh, te bharye abhutam so you will have to substitute a verb there in some way abhavat abhavatam also you can have so uh, dhata and vidhata's wives ayati and niyati were given in marriage to dhata and vidhata tayoho tayoho ityukte um, uh, ayati niyatyoho athava dhatra vidhatroho ityapi vaktum shakyate so those two had two children jatau sutau ubhau they had two children uh, pranaschaiva mrukanduscha markandeyo mrukandutasa taha ತೋ ವೇದಶಿರಾ ಜಗ್ನೆ ಪ್ರಾಣಸ್ಯಾಪಿ ಸುತ ಶೃಣು ನೋ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಅಂಡ್ ಮೃಕಂಡು ವೇರ್ ದೇರ್ ಚಿಲ್ಡ್ರನ್ ಪ್ರಾಬಬ್ಲಿ ಧಾತ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಯತಿ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಪ್ರಾಣ ವಿಧಾತ ಅಂಡ್ ನಿಯತಿ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಮೃಕಂಡು ಆಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಚಿಲ್ಡ್ರನ್ ನೋ ಮಾರ್ಕಂಡೇಯ ಮೃಕಂಡು ತಹ ಜಾತ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಮೃಕಂಡು ಮಾರ್ಕಂಡೇಯ ವಾಸ್ ಬಾರ್ನ್ ಮಾರ್ಕಂಡೇಯ ಋಷಿ Uh, some of the names will be very familiar but the other people would be very the, there is a mixture of both familiar and non familiar people we only remember those rishis who have uh, who have occurred frequently like for example markandeya rishi is the one who uh, is there in uh, uh, devi mahatmyam he is a great uh, devi bhakta and uh, devi mahatmyam comes from him so i remember markandeya maharishi more than prana prana is more like the pancha prana i remember the vedanta prana here but mrukandu rishi uh, we don't remember because he is not so famous whereas markandeya is very famous so pranas chaiva mrukanduscha these two were the children who were born for dhata and vidhata sutau bahu jatau markandeya mrukandu tah from uh, markand from mrukandu markandeya was born tatah from markandeya vedashiraha jagne pranasya api shrutam shrunu that is next this this part is going to go to the next shloka vedashiraha was born to markandeya pranasyapi sutam shrunu listen to pranas uh, progeny also pranasya kritiman putra there will be differences between gorakhpur press and this press in that you will have dyutiman it is all names so it's okay just substitute uh, um, as and when i will go by what i have given in this uh, slide so pranasya kritiman putra uh, pranas san is kritiman ರಾಜವಾಂಶ ತೋ ಅಭವತ್ ತಥ ಇತ್ಯುಕ್ತ ಕೃತಿಮತ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಕೃತಿಮನ್ ರಾಜವಾನ್ ವಾಸ್ ಬಾರ್ನ್ ತಥ ವಂಶ ಮಹಾಭಾಗ ವಿಸ್ತಾರ ಭಾರ್ಗವ ಗತ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹಿಂ ಫ್ರಮ್ ರಾಜವಾನ್ ಭಾರ್ಗವ ವಂಶ ದ ಭೃಗು ವಂಶ ಬಿಕೇಮ್ ವಿಸ್ತಾರ ಗತ ಇಟ್ ಬಿಕೇಮ್ ಬಿಗ್ 
So each one had one children. Probably Rajavan had lots of children, and hence there was a spread of that big vamsha. So Bhrugu vamsha became uh, uh, big after that. Vistaram kataha. Patni marichehe sambhutihi purnamasam asuyata. Marichehe patni sambhutihi. The wife of Marichi Maharishi was sambhuti. She gave birth to purnamasaha. Pournamasam Asuyata. So she, uh, Sambhuti and Marichi gave birth to Pournamasa. Virajaha Sarvagas Chaiva Tasya Putro Mahatmanaha. Tasya Mahatmanaha Putro. Tasya Pournamasa Sya Mahatmanaha Putro. Pournamasa has two children where Virajaha and Sarvagaha. There will be a difference here also, if I remember right. Vamsha Sankirtane Putrana Vadishye Aham Tayoho Dvija. He Dvija Maitreya Tayoho Putran Vamsha Sankirtane Vadishye Vamsha Sankirtane Vamsha Sankirtana Avasare Athava Vamsa Sankirtanartham Tej Tayoho Putran Vadishyami. So Viraja's son and Sarvaga's sons, I will tell you in order to. Mm, uh, 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 tell in detail about the ancestry Vamsha Sankirtane in the matter or in the subject matter of Vamsha Sankirtanam uh, talking about the ancestry I will also tell you about the children of Viraja and Sarvaga Smritischa Angiras of Patni um, uh, Prasutaha Kanyakaha Tata so Vamsha Sankirtane here is later in the Chaturthamsha or the Panchamamsha you will have the Vamsha Vamshavali description where uh, Viraja and Sarvaga's children will be talked about in detail. Next, he moves on to the next Rishi, which is Angirasaha. Angiras, Angirasaha Patni Smritihi. The wife of Angiras is Pat, uh, Smriti. Uh, she had a lot of Kanyakaha, many uh, daughters. Sinivali, Kuhuhu, these are all names of those daughters. Kuhuhu, Raka, Cha, Anumatihi, Tatha, four, four children. So, Sinivali, Sinivali uh, uh, Kuhuhu, Raka, Anumatihi. And then, Anasuya, Tatha. Now, these were the four children of Angiras and Smriti. Next is, Anasuya, Tathaiva, Atrehe, Jagne, Putran, Akalmashan. Atri's wife was Anasuya. And Anasuya gave birth, Jagne, she gave birth to Putrana Akalmashan, very Pavitra uh, uh, children, sons. She gave birth to many pure or more uh, pious children. Somam Durvasa Samchaiva Dattatreyam Cha Yoginam Prithyam Pulastya Bharyayam Dattolis Tatsuto Abhavati. The four children, three children of uh, uh, Anasuya are Somaha. Durvasa Saha, the Durvasaha and uh, uh, Dattatreya, Yogi Dattatreya was also Anasuya's uh, uh, son. So Soma is the moon, Chandraha, Durvasa Muni and Dattatreya. These were the children of Atri and Anasuya. Next, Pulastya Bharyayam Prithyam. Pulastya's wife is Preeti and they both had a child called Dattolihi. Dattolihi Tatsutaha, Pulastyasya Sutaha, Abhavatu. So Pulastya and Preeti had a child called Dattolihi. I think after a few more classes, I won't remember any of these names. Unless we keep uh, repeating it, Parayanam uh, Madri, you'll have to keep uh, saying the whole thing. Otherwise, you won't remember all these things. Imagine Parashara remembered these and said to Maitreya, Maitreya told it to Vidura in Bhagavatam. How much of memory capacity they must have had. Purva Janmani Yo Agastyaha Smritaha Swayam Bhuve Antare Kardamascha Avariyansha Sahishnuhucha Sutat Trayam Kramatu Shushuve Bharya Pulahasya. These were all Purva Janmani Yaha Agastyaha Iti Smritaha Sayeva Antare Swayam Bhuva Antare Swayam Bhuve Antare Swayam Bhuve Antare Manvantare in the Swayambhu Manvantara, one who was thought of as Agastya, the one who was born as Agastya in the earlier Janma, that is Dattoli. Yeah. Ah, Dattoli was the one who was born as Agastya in the earlier Janma during the Swayambhu Manu's. Uh, uh, Manmantara, Swayambhu Manu's time period. So, Swayambhuve Antare, 
यहा पूर्व जन्मनी अगस्त्य स्मृत वन हु वॉज बॉर्न एज अगस्त्य वन हु इज रिमेबर्ड एज अगस्त्य इन हिज अर्लियर जन्म ड्यूरिंग द स्वयंभू मन्वंतर हि वॉज बॉर्न एज दत्तोली पुलस्थ सन ओके दे ऑलसो हैड थ्री अदर चिलड्रन वन मिनिट लेट मी चेक आउट हूज चिलड्रन दीज आर पुलह चिलड्रन वर् कर्दम उर्वरीयान एंड सहिष्णु करेक्ट अर्वरीयान कर्दम अर्वरीयान सहिष्णु च सुतत्र क्षमा तो शुशुदे भार्य पुलह से प्रजापते पुलह प्रजापति हिस् वाइफ इज क्षमा तस्य भार्या क्षमा सुशुवे शी गेव बर्थ टू सुतत्र थ्री चिलड्रन विच इज कर्दम अवरीयान अर्वर और अर्वरीयान और उर्वरीयान देर आर डिफरेंट नेम्स फॉर दैट सहिष्णु दीज आर द्री चिलड्रन ऑफ पुलह एंड क्षमा नेक्स्ट इज क्रतो क्रतु हेड सन्नति सन्नति एज हिस् वाइफ एंड फ्रॉम हिम वर बॉर्न द वालखिल्य क्रतोश्च सन्नतिर्भार्यालखिल्यान असूयत वालखिल्या आर वेरी ग्रेट ऋषीज who were only the size of an angushta they were only the size of a, a, a thumb and uh, their their rishis they in uh, skanda puranam there is a surya stuti said by valakhilya that is when i read about uh, them uh, so uh, kratoho sannatihi bharya kratu's wife was sannati and uh, she gave birth to valakhilya rishis they were 60 in number षष्टि यानि सहस्राणि यतीनाम ऊर्धरे तसा अंगुष्ट पर्व मात्रण ज्वलदास्कर तेजसा बालखिल्या सुशुवे ओके सो सन्नति हु इज द वाइफ ऑफ क्रतु गेव बर्थ टू सिक्सटी वालखिल्य षष्टि सॉरी षष्टि सहस्राणि हाँ सॉरी सिक्सटी थाउजेंड वालखिल्या हू वेर ऑल यति हू वेर फोरमोस्ट अमंग द योगी एंड ऊर्धरे तसा दे वेर ऑल सेलिब्रेट एंड देन अंगुष्ट दे डिड नॉट मैरी अंगुष्ट पर्व मात्रण दे वेर ओनली अंटिल द नोड ऑफ द थंब पर्व देर साइज वॉज ओनली द साइज ऑफ द नोड ऑफ अ थंब दैट्स इट एंड देन ज्वलत भास्कर तेजसा their tejas or their uh, luster was like jwalat bhaskara it was like that of a sun urjayam vasishthasya sapta ajayanta wives sutah vasishtha's wife urja the, there were seven children born to vasishtha and urja rajah gotrah urdhva bahuscha savanah anagah tatha sutapah shukrah इति एते सर्वे सप्त ऋषय अमला दीज वर् दयस ऋषी सेवन ऋषी हूवर बॉर्न टू वसीष्ठ द सेवन ई हेव जस्ट ऐडेंटिफाइड रज गोत्र ऊर्ध्व बाहु सवन अनघ सुतपा एंड शुक्र यो असौ अग्नि द नेक्स्ट वन इज अग्नि भृगु भव मरीचि अंगिरा पुलस्थ पुल क्रतु अत्रि वसिष्ठ वन्हि वन्हि इज अग्नि सो यसौ अग्नि अभिमानी ब्रह्मण तनय अग्रज सो अग्नि इज द अभिमानी पुत्र ऑफ ब्रह्म शी इज द प्रॉब्ली अभिमानी इत्युक्ते ही इज वन हु इज वेरी अभिमानी देवता अग्नि अग्ने अभिमानी देवता इति सो एव्री फॉर्म दट यू सी औट सैड एव्री आबजेक्ट विषय दट यू सी औट सैड हेज एन अभिमानी देवता लाइक हिमवत पर्वत हेज अ चाइल्ड गौरी हाउ कैन दट बी दट इज बिकॉज देर इज एन अभिमानी देवता कॉल हिमान फॉर द पर्वतम फॉर्म दट इज देर इन द वर्ल्ड तथा अग्नि स्वरूप से अभिमानी देवता तो अग्रि देवता अथवा ऋषि स एव ब्रह्मण अग्रज तनय हि इज द फस्ट सन्फ ब्रह्म ज्येष्ठपुत्र सह ब्रह्मण 
Tasmat swaha sutan lebhe from him, from Agni. So swaha is the uh, wife of Agni and she gave birth to uh, children, sutan lebhe. Three, there were three children, Udara Ojasaha, uh, uh, they had a great strength, Hedvija, Pavakam, Pavamanam, cha, Shuchim Chapi, Jala Ashinam. They were all uh, three children, which is Pavaka, Pavamana, and Shuchi. These three sons were born to Agni and Swaha, and they were people who uh, uh, ate water, which is they dried up water quickly. Okay. Teshantu Santatau Anye Chatwarim Chatucha Panchacha 45. They had 45 children. That is Pavaka, Pavamana, and Shuchi had 45 children. Evam Ekona Panchashatvanayaha. Ah, no, no, no. After these three, there were 45 other children. Evam Ekona Panchashatvanayaha Parikirtitaha. Including Agni. Ha, okay, including the father Agni, because 3 plus 45 is 48, including the father, that is why we have 49 Agni. Okay, so evam ekona panchashat vannayaha parikirtitaha. Kathyante vannayascha ete pita putra trayancha yatu. Iti ekona panchashat. That is what has been created here. Pita, the father. Traya putra trayamcha, and then those three children gave birth to Tesham Santato in their Santati, in their uh, uh, progeny. You have 45 children, and hence all of them together. Appa, the uh, Tata, Pulla, Pera, Appa, right? Agni, Pavaka, Pavamana, Shuchi, and then 45 uh, children. All of them together are called Vanhayaha. They, they, that is the collection of Agni. Pitaraha, Brahmana, Srishtaha, Vyakhyataha, Ye Maya, Tava. Now I have told you about the ten, the, the Pitaraha, those fathers that we spoke about in the seventh Adhyaya, the seven Prajapatis that uh, Brahma created, which were spoken in the seventh adhyaya ye maya vyakhyataha tava that which i have told you now that is parashara has now told maitreya about the pitras prajapatis that brahma had created before agni shvattaha barihishadaha anagnayaha sagnayaha cha ye tebhyaha swadha sute jagnye menam vai dharinin tatha that is next. So, Agnishvata Barihishadaha. Uh, one minute, I need to check this. Um, Ag uh, these were said before in the seventh Adhyaya about Agni, Agnishvata, Sagni. Uh, these were the things that he said earlier. Um, Through them, ah, okay. Swadha is the uh, um, wife of Agnishvata, Barihishadaha, uh, who both are Anagni, and then the rest are Sagni. The in this fifty, the, in this forty-nine Agnis that we said earlier, that is Agni, and then his three sons and his progeny of forty-five. Among those forty-nine. Or among those 45, it could be probably that. Among those, you there are some which are Anagni, which is Agnishvata and Barhishadaha. The other is Sagni. That is, it can either be with the, the power of Agni or without the power of Agni. Something like think of a Prakasham without the flame. Maybe uh, like a coal or uh, a hot iron which has been burnt in the fire. It still has that heat of the fire, but it is it does not have the real flame. So it is like an, ag an agni, hmm? like indhana, any fuel. From them, Swadha gave birth to uh, Sute, two daughters who are Nena and Dharini. So Swadha uh, gave birth to two daughters who are Mena and Dharini, te ubhe brahmavadinyau yoginyau chapi ubhe dvija uttama jnana sampanne sarvaihi samuditaihi gunaihi. With all of these gunas, with all good qualities, these two were Brahmavadini. Brahmavadini and Sadhyavadu are two types of women. Sadhyavadu are those 
who are uh, whose minds are tuned towards family life whereas a brahmavadini is a woman whose mind is tuned towards yogic life academic life and yogic uh, 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 path so these two mena and dharini were brahmavadini they had an academic bent of life uh, li- uh, uh, mind and then they were also yoginyo they were also yogini who were following the path of yoga yama niyama etc ubhe uttama gnana sampanne they also not only were they academically oriented they also practically they were yogic uh, yoginis and they also had the discriminating power that is they had the gnanam in them uttama gnana sampanne sarvaihi samuditaihi gunaihi with all the guna gunas that they had they, uh, they were people who pursued uh, uh, brahma yogam and gnanam इत्येषा दक्षकन्या कथिता अपत्यसति श्रद्धावान् संस्मरेन् संस्मरेत् एताम् अनपत्यः न जायते सो व्हाई हैव वी रेड दिस अध्याय ऑफ ट्वेंटी श्लोक टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस पर्सन गेव बर्थ टू दिस पर्सन दिस पर्सन गेव बर्थ टू दिस पर्सन श्रद्धावान् संस्मरेत् ए पर्सन विथ डिवोशन हु रिमेम्बर्स दिस संतति विल नेवर बी विदाउट ए संतति अनपत्यः न जायते इन हिज फॅमिली देयर विल नॉट बी एनी पर्सन विदाउट ए चाइल्ड सो दक्षकन्यानाम एषा अपत्य संतति ही कथिता ऑल ऑफ दीस विमेन हु हैव मैरिड द प्रजापतीस आर ऑल दक्षस चिल्ड्रन you go back to the saptam adhyaya you will understand so daksha kanya nam apatya santati hi esha katita now this is the progeny of daksha's children daksha's uh, 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 daughters that i have said katita shraddhavan etam samsmaret a person with devotion must remember this santati this progeny anapatya na jayate he will never be born as a person without any children iti विष्णुपुराणे प्रथमांशे दशमोध्याय ओके नारायण नमस्कृत्य नरंजैव नरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती वाचम तथो जय मुदीर एनी क्वेश्चन सद्य न इमीडियटली वधु इज वैफ और ब्राइड सद्यो वधु इधल दर् इज अ धर्मशास्त्र हारीत की धर्मशास्त्र हारीत धर्मशास्त्र अदल वो इट इस सेड दट फॉर विमेन दे हेव टू बी यज्ञोपवीत धारण मस्ट बी डन फॉर् विमेन फॉर् एनी टाइप ऑफ विमेन इफ शी इज अ ब्रह्मवादिनी देन जस्ट इस हाउ फॉर् मेन यू डू उप यज्ञोपवीत धारण एंड सेंड दम टू गुरुकुल इन द सेम वे द वुमन इज आलो इफ शी हेज दट बेन्ट ऑफ मैंड देन शी गोज टू गुरुकुल just as how the uh, uh, men go if she doesn't have any interest then at least before her marriage you will have to do yagnopavitam for her and get her married it's there in dharma shastra today the practice of yagnopavitam is not there for women yeah so it is two types uh, and brahmavadini ah sadyovadhu and brahmavadini yeah okay chulungo agnishvata agnishvatangra word Uh, I, I, we come across in the sarpanam ag uh, agni la vandu podradhu nu artham illa aatham na illa sarpanathu agni karyam illa enak theriyadhu agnishvata padibihi padibihi devigane so adnal da anagnayaha nu potrukku adukku correct ah irundhadu oh okay okay good good cheth the next week paapom namaskaram